and welcome to my channel study with Pradipto. Today I will discuss week 7 assignment 7 answers of the course introduction to machine learning. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. I will upload all the assignment answers of this course in this channel so please do subscribe. Now the first question is define active learning. So the answer will be option C. An iterative learning process where the model selects the most informative data points for leveling. Okay. Now here is the proof option uh, C. Okay. Now question number 2, given 100 distinct data points, if you sample 100 times with replacement, what is the expected number of distinct points you will obtain? So the answer will be approximately 63. Now here is the proof, that is approximately 63, option B. Now question number 3, what is the key difference between bootstrapping and cross-validation? So the answer will be option C, bootstrapping creates multiple samples with replacement while cross-validation creates subsets without replacement. Now here you can see, option C will be the answer for question number 3. I already uploaded some videos in this course, so if you face some difficulties in understanding the NPTEL lecture, then please go to my video. I will give the link in my description, so please go and watch, you will clearly understand the concept. Now question number 4. Consider the following contribution matrix for binary classification problem. What are the precision, recall and accuracy of this classifier? So the answer will be option A. This is 0.81, recall 0.85 and accuracy 0.83. Now here you can see, this is the solution, that is option A. Okay, please remember this equation. You can also see this type of problems in the playlist which I already uploaded. Okay. Now question number 5. You will see for your newly trained model 0.5, is your model prediction completely random? So the answer will be ROC curve is needed to derive this conclusion. Here you can see question number 5, the option will be option C. Okay, this is option C. Now question number 6, you are building a model to detect cancer, which metric you will prefer for evaluating your model? So the answer will be sensitivity. Now here you can see, question number 6, the answer will be option B, that is sensitivity. Now question number 7, you have two binary classifiers A and B, A has 0% accuracy and B has 50% accuracy, which classifier is most useful? So the answer will be option A, that is A. Now here you can see that option A. Now question number 8. This is the question and the answer will be option B, that is it will have 0% accuracy. Now here is the proof, it will have 0% accuracy. So please subscribe my channel if you get some help from this video. Thank you for watching the video, see you in the next video.